named the starter because he kind of almost flipped over you in a sense. And when he became the starter, how did you keep your head up and, and just keep moving on? Because obviously you played well since. Well, Tim's a great kid and he's a really hard worker and he's very talented. And when it happened, I you know I I wasn't very surprised because he is such a, he is a great player. He's a great player in high school and, and he's very talented and he can he can do a lot with the ball. So I mean, I was I was proud for him. We we've been working together since the since the summer and. Uh, I was excited for him to get the opportunity to play against some, some of these teams that we played. Didn't bother you a little bit? No, I mean, he, he, he worked his butt off since he got here. He really has. I mean, he's put in the time. He, he definitely did put in as much as he could, and he, he deserved the spot. What did you do differently then? How, how did you ascend to here? Talk about what you did in terms of hanging in and, and keeping getting better. You know, um, ever since, I think, the summer and even before that, maybe back in January, I, I set out myself to work as hard as I can every single day and get better every single day, no matter how I was feeling, no matter um, what the circumstances was that day. Um, if I got better each day, then um, at some point I was going to get my shot. And I had no idea I was going to play in Buffalo was when I, first, when I got my first snap. I had no idea I was going to play in Cincinnati. I had no idea I was going to play in a few of those games. But um, I think the best advice I got was from, from Coach Day was that you never know when you get your shot. You know, you can. There's some games in the NFL and college where maybe four quarterbacks get hurt in a game and the fifth guy gets in. So you never know when your opportunity is. So I think the biggest thing for me was even back in January, I looked at myself. I'm like, at some point you're going to get your shot, so you're going to have to be ready no matter what. So. I mean, last couple of months since you know, I think. Um, I think the biggest development for many guys, especially quarterbacks, happens in camp. Um, we're here 24-7 basically um, at that point. It's nonstop football, and I think at that point during camp, um, when it's uh, when it's grueling, and um, I think the biggest thing was pushing through it. And uh, I think all of us as quarterbacks, we pushed through it, and then when we broke that wall where it got tough, I think then we started to understand the game a little bit more. And ever since camp, when we developed that mindset of where just keep pushing through, keep pushing through, no matter what the circumstances is, I think that's when I developed the most um, as a quarterback. And throughout the 